Maybe you can show me how to love Maybe I'm going through a drought You don't even have to do too much You can turn me on with just a touch A brand new product from AKK. That's right, it is the 5 watt smallest form factor in the world VTX, yes, TX 5000 AC. So it's the um, brand new one that AKK Technology has brought out. So we're pretty excited to um, be one of the first in the world to review it. So yeah. here we go. That's right, and check the links below. Um, yes, for the affiliate link and help out the channel. That's right, and what is the range? Because I know it's 96 channels, which is insane. Yeah, so so the biggest one on the, the, on the channel before was 80 channels, which we're, um, if you want to see that, click the link above. But um, uh, yeah, we've done a couple of them, so check those out. But um, yeah, 80 channels we thought was uh, enough, but no, they've gone to 96 channels, which is insane, so there you go. That's, That's right, and they've also changed a couple of the um, functions around here, yes. just make it more user-friendly. Yes, yeah, so... The, and what, because we were talking about the frequency, well, what about the power? No, uh, the power... Not all people want to do, you know, massive distance. Yeah. Uh, they might not want to do massive distance, but this one can do it all. So it's uh, 25 pit mode, uh, 200, 500, 1 watt, 3 watts, and 5 watts, so you can just select between those options. Yeah, so big thanks to AKK Technology for coming aboard once again. Yes. And check their links out for all the products below. Yes, so without further ado, I'm Harry. And I'm Richard. And let's just jump straight into unboxing and testing it. Yeah. Okay, and 3, 2, 1, race! Hey, we're back. Yeah, so, so we're doing another unboxing for you, review, and wiring, what? testing yes, of the TX the brand 5000 new. AC brand new product from T AKK. Yes, so this is the ultra long range version, which is the extended ultra long range version. So 96 80, channels, yeah. 80 channels, which is a heck of a lot. We're gonna go 96 they've made. That's right, there you go. Brand new, can check them out on their link in the description below. That's right, and it um, punches out a maximum of five watts. Yes, so quite impressive. So that's uh, the biggest one that we've ever reviewed. So make sure you check the yes. link above for the other ones. Yes, that we've the done. other ones that we've done on the channel. So check them out. That's right. Yes, okay, so. Or, or check them out for the future ones that we review. Yes, who knows, who knows. So there you go. And also, but it's not just a review. What is it? We've got, it's a lifestyle. A lifestyle, okay, there you go. And also what we're gonna try to do is a world's first. What's we're, that? We've been watching the Olympics, the Olympic Games, and we thought they do synchronized swimming, so we thought we'd do synchronized unboxing. There you go. World first for you guys. We'll give it a go. There you go. <laughs> Might be a bit out of sync, but, <laughs> but that's okay. That's okay. Um, anything else we need to add before we jump into the um, unboxing? No, but we could say that it's, it's 25. Hang on, I'll get the notes here. 25, 200, 500, 1 watt, 3 watts, and 5 watts. There okay. you go. That's why I pre prepared that earlier. There you go. Right. Who knows? Okay, so there you go. So 3 watts and then 5 watts. That's right, and it also has a cooling fan again like normal, yes. which is always good because you don't want things to overheat when you get and into the, the uh, 5 watt area. And uh, what do you reckon it will run on? Uh, it'll be a 6S, LiPo. 6S? Yeah. It, it can do a 4S, but on the lower end of the, lower end of the voltage of the battery, yeah. you, you might want to regulate it at least. So you could probably run it on a 3S. Heck, you could probably run it on a 2S, provided you have that regulator. You, you'd need the regulator, yeah, but then you'd cut down the battery shot. Yeah, yeah, but, but yeah. at that point, it, 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 wouldn't, it wouldn't matter, would it? Because you're just trying to get it to go. Exactly. So there you go. Okay, so... Well, we're not saying it's feasible. We're saying you could do it. Could do it, yeah. That's it. That's okay, right. so there you go. We'll um, jump straight into it. Okay. I got my scissors. Have you got yours? Yeah. Okay. There you go. So we go right-handed or... I can't really cut left-handed. We'll just go go right-handed. Okay. So yeah. all chopped. It's okay. still synchronized, right? So there you go. So here we go. So unboxing commencing. <laughs> How are you going to do it? Yeah. Okay. Ah, oh, my technique is terrible. I think it's because the camera's on there. Got it? Yeah. <laughs> so maybe I need a bit more test uh, practice. Okay, practice so you turn to the left. Like that. Like that. Like a cook now down the hill. Oh, okay. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Just want to cut my arm. Just want to cut anything inside. That'd be bad. 
Okay, turn to the other side. Yep, now we'll cut this off. Uh, oh, you can do it like that. Okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, look at that. Okay, then you got this and then you go down. What are you going to do now? Put, gonna put it down. Okay. Okay, there you go. Cool. Okay, okay so ready? unboxing. And three, so front, two, front, one. Front, front. Front and back. Back. And then sides. Okay. Okay, box out. <laughs> you got yours? Uh, right hand. Right hand. There you go. Down, turn. Oh, yours is upside down. <laughs> turn and then around like that. Oh, they can't read it, so we'll go back. There you go. Okay. And then we'll go tubes out, down. Oh, man. And then we go box. Out to the left, and then under. There you go. That was our synchronized swimming for you there. <laughs> okay, so yeah. So it's the all channel version. Yes. Uh, and yeah. Okay, so Just should we straight into it? Well, what we'll do is we'll, we'll leave these guys up here. Yeah. And we'll do these. So okay. you do it at the same time. Ready? Ready? Yep, sure. So off with here. <laughs> uh -huh. mm -hmm. And pull off the tag. I pull off the tag? Yep. Okay, and then open it. Oh, okay. You're getting longer fingernails there. Yeah, ready? Open. Okay, yep. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. I went terrible at synchronized swimming. There you go, hang on. And uh, really? <laughs> okay, there you go. So that's the um, 5.8. There you go. 5.8. 5.8. There you go, that's the 5.8 antenna. And since we've only got one measuring tape uh, roller, it is the I think like other times it is 160 and just like yours, yours will be 160 as well. So cool. That's exciting. And this is the 5 watt, oh, 5 gigahertz, sorry. <laughs> there you go. There you go. And we use the 5.8 New Zealand. Yeah. Other, other countries are different things. Different things, different things. And that's cool. Oh, there you go. There you go. And that's the uh, 5 gigahertz one. It actually should be my right hand. Uh, should be. That's okay, exciting, exciting. Uh, we'll just pop these under there. Alrighty. Okay, okay, so we want to start with maybe measure something? We did, I measured that. Oh, okay. Uh, okay, we'll just What about weighing? Weighing? Or should we, should we open the next one up? We'll move these to the side. Okay, we'll just go. We'll just put them there. There you go, exciting stuff. So maybe open the packet. You want to open the packet? Yeah. Huh? Okay. Mm -hmm. Can't get it. This won't be sinking out. I'm struggling. Don't, don't break it. Try this one. Try, try. We'll stop synchronization. <laughs> stop synchronization. Does it give you like a like a um, like a bronze at the Olympic? Um, I think you'd be disqualified. DQ, DQ, DQ. Points off. <laughs> Not synchronized enough. Which way around? You're, you're that way. Try to. Oh, hang hanging around the other hand. Isn't that fine? No, I'm still trying to do it. Okay, yeah, cool. You done? Come on, Joe. I win. I think I think we got Put a. Away. I think we got a time penalty there. Time penalty. That's okay. No DQ. Okay, sweet. You ready for this part? Yeah. And lift. And lift. There you go. Looks the same. Funny that. Funny that. We'll spin it around. As you can see. Go to the side. Upside down. No, right other way. Yeah. There you go. There you go. Same stuff. Okay, so you open it up with the right hand? Yep, right hand. <laughs> Why don't you keep going with it? <laughs> keep the gag out. <laughs> Never break the gag. Never break the gag. Okay, there you go. So this, oh, oh, oh. You got it? Yeah. This is the little... TX5000 AC. I'll bring it up a bit closer. Where are you at? Let's bring it up. Look, you guys. Can you see? Hope you can. Okay. There you go. Closer to you guys. There you go. I think you saw it. Yeah, I think so. That's, uh, I mean, it looks pretty cool. So, right? yeah, so it's got the, if you, well, it's got 14.6 to 28 volts. Oh, yes. And a 14 s lipos. Yep, so that's so 14 point eight. Yeah, so, so, so yeah, so, 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 so 60 minute. Ground, it's got smart audio, it's got video in, ground, and 5 volt output for your cameras. That's right. And it's obviously analog that we're talking about. Analog yes, that's setup. Right. 
and yes that's and there's only one button here on this one and they've got leds on the sides so they've changed it from the previous one that yes. we, we just reviewed um yeah, yeah. so there's little leds oh. Oh, maybe I'll move it over there so you can see. Little LEDs on the side. Whereas I think on the last one, they're on the back. Yeah, yeah, but so it, that's makes an it makes it a bit better so then you can have it facing outwards and then you can still see the LEDs. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah. That's good. That's a good design change. Yeah, but I mean, after all, it's the, it's the new, it's brand new and improved, right? That's it's right, that's right. Like the Terminator. Yep. And brand same new. kind of size uh, antenna, MMCX, and then an SMA connector, and that'll sit you back at. What do you reckon? How long is that? Oh, um, about nine? Just under? Yeah, about nine, 90 millimeters. 90 millimeters? Yep. And then, so that'll go into there. I'll just leave it at, just leave it there. That's right, and that'll go into what are they? What are they called, these ones? So this is the SMA. Yeah, oh, so the, those are these antennas. And then, was it? I thought it was MMC, yeah. Oh, all right. It's a tiny little baby one, anyway. And then what that does is just plug straight into this yeah. part here. Yep. Pretty sure. So you don't even really need to worry yep, about it. Really. MMCX, yep. there you go. Yeah, I mean you don't even need to worry about it because it just goes straight in. That's it, you forget about it. And the connectors. There you go. And they must have some sort of voltage right there. Yeah, voltage right there. Yeah, a little, little back, as they say. A little back on the side. And what measurement's that one? I'll measure that, I guess. Oh yeah, measure it. The voltage right there. The voltage. And what else can we tell you? So th th those wires, if I can do it. It's about what, 11.5 centimeters. So this is like 110 mm -hmm. millimeters. Yes, and we can tell you that um, yeah, it's got a built in cooling fan, OHD configurator on smart audio, and it's got that 5 volt output, which is great. And the coloring sc scheme will be yeah, four, uh, there'll be four blue LEDs. Well, indicate, I'll bring it up on the screen, the uh, just 12 comes up bands, there, comes up there. and then the power select will be in green for the six different levels, and that'll, you know, like 25. Right, so this, the same sort of thing as the last yeah, time, right? One, one you was like hold, you hold the button down, didn't you, and then, mm. and then you do like a quick tap. Quick tap, and that'll change the um, power bands. It was quite and good, the, it wasn't the, too the bad. The 96 power, uh, 96 channels will appear on the screen here, so there's quite a range there. Oh, there's enough, I mean, if you're 96, I mean, you're not going to mm. run out of... And uh, what else is there? Yep, push it on. That's cool. It's, it's good. It's good. So it's, it's basically, it's, 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 was it three watt? Was the last one we did? Ultra long range? Uh, four watt. Mm -hmm. Oh, three watt. Yeah. Three watt. Yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. Same size. Same, same size. Same size. Size factor. But, but but they've just improved the design with the LEDs on the side and a, a bigger power. Yeah. And more more um more frequency bands, right? No, oh, so, so it really is. It really the is best. the best of the best. The smallest in the world. That's right. It's definitely the world's first. Um, small form factor by what? Okay, and so uh, we'll, we'll check those measurements. As, you know. Oh, yeah, you gotta check them. So, measurements are my one says 36. Does it say 36 there? Uh, oh, I think it says, I reckon, read 36. Would you read that? Oh, yeah, on the back. And then that's mm -hmm. the 36 as well. 36, 36, and then 36. what is the dimensions? It doesn't actually say in the description. Oh, the height. Well, I'll go to the bolt because that's the highest one. That there is. 14.5? 14 14.5? 14 yeah. Okay. 14.5? 14.5, yeah. Depth. Depth. Sweet. Okay. And the, and the little, the, the, the holes of the mounting thing. It says it's... Uh, it says 30.5, was it? 30.5 between the holes. Yeah, that's about right. Yeah, I'll check that. And then I'll check that over here. Yep. Spot on. Mm -hmm. So that that's good. That means that's that everything's... Um, lines up with what they recommend so there you go so that's that's all going good and then last but not least we need to do some kind of oh yeah measure. you measure it yeah why not so we'll do it in reverse so the camera can see oh yeah that's a good idea so we'll just turn it on so if not i can't see it can't. <laughs> i really can't see okay so it's in grams okay so we work in grams in new zealand so that's fine okay so there's no point measuring both of them no 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 okay, i mean so you could but it's a bit, a bit strange so it says 26 grams. 26 grams, so we'll put, um, we'll yeah. just put them all on. Isn't it? We'll check the next one. Do, do those ones individually, because that's the, because you might have a different antenna. Right, true. And that says 13 grams. 13 grams. Okay, so. And then antenna and cables, because that would always be on there. Yeah, with the little adapter. And that cable. would be, maybe that's probably, they might have a different antenna. Oh, okay, so that's 34 grams. 34 grams. 
the game we'll put the antenna on top just in if, they, if they choose to do that it's 46 grams 46 grams so there you go exciting stuff on the channel of the h and drone racing show so just um so check the link above and just so you know it goes the power point of it is what was the link for why are we checking the link above? With the product. Oh yes, let's check out the link above to see this on the screen. That's right. And no, no, you, you just see it on the screen. You just see it they come up. They don't click it. It's yeah. not interactive. No, it's not really. One time I saw, um, it was on it's Netflix not. and then um, Bear Grylls had it. did like a four dimensional thing and you could click You click, like, like, do you uh, 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 chase the bear or do you chase the yes. tiger? Maybe we could do that. There you go, YouTube. You, you know, um, a bit more interactive maybe. A bit maybe. more interaction there, you know, four, four dimension. As a creator, that'd be quite cool. As, as a creator, would be quite good. A little bit like goosebumps. Goosebumps. The the book, you could choose this option, or you could choose this option. Okay, so getting back to uh, the the matter at hand. Yes. Yeah, so the, the TX five thousand AC. Yes. Just flows off the tank there. Um, anyway, I guess you got to call it's it. It's the model, so. no? The TX five thousand AC. Yeah. So I guess it's it's like a Terminator, right? Yes. What, the TX. Trent. Terminator. TX. What yeah. what was he called? What's his number? It's the TX-1000. No, oh, 5000. So, so this is the fifth model of the Terminator. The fifth model of the Terminator. That's actually pretty cool. Versions. So there you go, it's kind of cool. Okay, and was it 96 channels? It was, wasn't it? Yeah, 96 channels, which is phenomenal. Yeah. You know, normally, I mean, what's a normal one? You don't get 80 even on some of the other well, um, ones. What were originally uh, on, um, what was on the next generation? 30? It was like six channels. Yeah, not many. Next, I mean, next we, wave. Next wave. Oh, it was cool though. Yeah, it was cool. I mean, yeah. it's all you needed. R all race you band need. one to six. Yeah, now you can choose. You can actually choose nine to six. six. There you go. It's pretty cool. Even better. Yeah. There you go. It's good to see that there's um, you know, um, you know, refinement. Yeah. And, uh, and technology. That's good. Yeah. And also because of the small form factor, you could put it in lots of different things. Is. Hmm. You can put it as, we, as we will find out when we when we install it and whatever we do next. Yes, exactly. You'll find out in a second. Um, you can put it in, a, in like a five inch uranium. Yep, yep. Like if you have a battery was stripped to the top or the bottom, it's not going to be a problem. Yeah, or you just make a little housing and put it on the outside. As long as it's done correctly. Yeah, it's right. It's not going to damage anything. No, it's right. Or, I mean, what, 7 inch? Or you could do a macro quad. Yeah, or, or, or a Cine Whoop. Cine, sorry, not no, Cine, Cine Whoop. Cine, Cine Lifter, I mean. Oh, Cine Lifter, yeah, easy. Yeah. yeah. Or an X Class. Yep. No or, or you go to the other side, you go to the plane world. Yeah, right? you can just put it in a plane. Or VTOL. Or glider or something you can or a jet a there's plenty of room in those what are we going to do next we're going to install them show you how to install them sure yeah 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 but we'll do it on a, um, an upcoming we always like to do something functional so yes. rather than just um unbox and then that's it make a 3d design in our yep. software cad software and that will be like that on the um, aircraft the aircraft and it's actually a helicopter Put it on a helicopter it's on, a, on the sustainable RC helicopter. So you may continuing that series. Yes. That's right. So um, yeah, if you are check a long link time above. follower of the show, and that's what will be carrying that's on. That's right. Yeah. We'll turn into a, the FPV added to it. There you go. That's right. So it's it's going to be be we're going to continue that series. So yeah, make sure you subscribe to um, watch that. Yeah. So AKK is um, is helping us out with that. Thank you very much. It won't need both VTXs. No. So we'll put the other one in, in another upcoming. Yes. Another upcoming we'll, project we'll, for yes. you guys. So so it always wants to be practical on the show. Yes. Always. And we'll also be doing range testing as well. That's right, coming up. Yeah, it's just a, in a couple of minutes. Just a good example of, um, you know, you know, it's all good in theory wise to see it. Yeah. And we would also want to see it in real life too. That's right. Yeah, you, you got to um, kind of push it. It's all it's all very good to do it in a, in a, on the desk. Yes. But exactly. you do want to you don't want to see you do actually want to see a, um, a practical application. Yes. And we'll take it to um, our backyard. There you go. This is our backyard, but we're going to go to another backyard. Which is like what, a couple of meters away. Yes, exactly. So different location. We'll carry on with that, and we'll see you in the next section. Yeah. See ya. Okay, so we're back. This is what we are mounting it to the sustainable um, fly bar RC helicopter. Yes. So it's uh, one from a previous episode that uh, we another yeah. So there you go. So we're going to be um, flying it with FPV. So here we go. So I was going to mount it about here. I was thinking, or we were thinking. So. Um, about there, so we'll put the, and there's the FPV part there, so we're thinking like that. The camera. Then. The camera, so we wanted to put the, the VTX and about there, is what we're thinking, right, Richard? Really? Yeah, about there. You know, so it's, it's, it stays to the body, but it's not going to be bumped by anything. So that and should... it's going to keep the center of gravity fine. Yes, exactly, so, and keep the center of gravity. Yes, so um, we're going to put it, I made it on software over here. It's going to be sitting there like that, in the, on these mounts. Like that, bang, 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 and then there's going to be a camera 
Um, here's a, here's a FPV camera. So we normally fly at 45 degrees. We were flying just normally. So there you go. It's, um, it's going to go into that mount there, slide in there like that. Right. And that'll be, it'll offset the camera like here. How about that? It's just slightly to the. It'll look like it's on the skid, basically. Yes, yeah, so it's, hang on, just make it so you can actually see. Yeah, it's gonna be like that. What do you reckon, about there? Yeah, about that. Sweet. There you go. So now, off to the prayer. All right, so we've got the camera and the VTX in place. That's the 3D printed part that we made. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right there. And, that's, and that's installed on there quite well, and then the camera's there as well. So yeah, so it's all going good. I just need to do some, last minute I gotta put on the camera, the antennae, sorry. I'm gonna, we'll do that while we're right Just there. put it over there. Yep. Or, it can't really go up there at the moment, so. <laughs> probably just lie on the back there for now. It's not the ideal location. When you do an antenna, you should always have it vertical, but when we get a smaller one, we just um, screw it on and then put it up. And, or otherwise you just put a mini one. Yeah, that's what I mean. We, we might, might just, we might just have, use a mini one. But for now... And what was the wiring? It's pretty straightforward wiring, wasn't it? That's right, yeah, the, the wiring were pretty straightforward. They just plugs into the side over here. I'm not sure and you can see. It, was... it just plugs in over here with the wiring. So basically, it was battery positive, battery negative. Mm -hmm. and, and we skipped all the others and we just went video in and then five volts. Five volt out to power the camera. And five and negative to, and to be the opposite on the camera. Okay, so... Uh, we just managed to mount the um, FPV camera and VTX. So there's the camera there. On the side, yep. So that's the, the live feed, yep, live feed. So we thought we'd mount it on the side. I know you could have mounted on the front or somewhere else, but we we want to mount it on the side just for a bit of interesting view, just to make things, you know, if it wasn't difficult enough to um, fly how I got, we thought we'd just add a little, make it more difficult. So. So anyway, so we got the antenna, the MMCX coming out there, and then to the SMA, antenna, and then to the antenna. 5.8 yeah. gigahertz antenna that's sitting out the back, and you can see the lights, the green, the the blue, and the red up the top there. Yeah. And the button we put it so we can just tap it to change the frequencies. Yeah. The, the band frequencies. Yeah. So so it's all good. It's um looking good. It was pretty. What would you think of the wiring? Pretty easy. Yeah, pretty easy. Straight forward. Straight forward. Yeah. That's just follow the um. Very. Very simple. Documentation, easy. Yeah, no worries. Looking good. Looking and, good. Um, what are we going to do next with it? I uh, think we do it. Go and do a field test, eh? Go and take it out for a race test. Yeah, why not? Let's go see what happens. Okay, we'll see each other in the field. Yeah, this is uh, Romeo Mike coming in nice and clear. Yeah, I can hear you. Um, hopefully uh, the test works. Um, yep, so just got to plug it in now, yeah? Over. Yeah, just plug in my goggles now. I'm in location. Yeah, you got all the GoPros and, and DVR running. Just let me know when you're all ready and then I'll plug it in. Yeah, all ready, go for it. Yeah, I got ya. I got ya. There you go. Okay, well, maybe I'll point it out towards you. I don't know if that's a good idea, but I'll try anyway. Yeah, she's totally going, Harry. Let's go. Absolutely, it's working. Yeah, I can see your hand waving. You are good. That's great, that's great. So what? Let's say one one, I think. Yeah, one one, yeah. Yeah, an another successful test, well done. Thank you, AKK. Thank you, thank you. Okay, 500 milliwatt test right now, 500 milliwatts, over. Can you hear me? Yeah, good, good copy, can see you. Uh, yeah, it, it's pretty good. Still not as good as the one watt, but, um, you know, punch output, but it, it's, I can still see you very clear. It's great stuff, this stuff from AKK. Cool. Is uh, that all good now? Yeah, I think that's a wrap, eh? And we're back. So, back off the range test. What did we learn? We learned that 
It's good. It works. Yeah. There you go. Pretty that, simple. That, right? that was that was it. But we um, also <laughs> also learned that you can mount it. How to mount it on a helicopter? Oh yeah, we, we just made it up. We just uh, stick it on there with um, cable ties. Does the job. There you go. Um, Doesn't yeah. move, right? No, it's solid. It's three, 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 three. Mount camera. I think maybe if I did it again, maybe I have the camera mount a little bit down a little bit. But I mean, we normally fly at forty-five, so. There you go. It looks right, like if you look at it like that yeah. from the side, like when you'll be flying, because that would be the angle of attack. It's probably, it's, yeah, be fine. looks fine. Yeah. Yeah. And, um, looks and also so. inside, we we didn't actually say that before, but we, we were testing and actually pairing the camera butt with a 4S like that. It, it did suggest in the manner to use a 6S, but clearly a 4S works. So there you go. And we didn't just have it on for like 10 seconds, we had it on for half an hour. At half least. an hour, an hour, yeah. 20 minutes. 20, 20 minutes. 20 yeah. minutes. Yeah, it's yeah. quite a while. Um, and the, the functions of it quite easy. Um, we were mainly playing with the power function, which is the holding green it down light. until the green light flashes, and then go click, 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 and then you are all good. And the yeah, power function that you want. And the test that we conducted today was uh, 25 uh, milliwatts, which is pit mode, and um, all and the way up to 1 watt. Yes, that's true. And I mean, we didn't see the need to go to 5 watt because that's, you know, we're not that far away, so there you yeah. go. Yeah, that's right. It worked, it worked. And, uh, could other... you see me at for, um, pit mode? No, I can no. see I can see a faint outline, but as soon as you bumped up to like the 200, I could just see. Yeah. When it got to the, the 1 watt, I, it was crystal But clear. that's not using like the most deluxe um, patches for you to pick it up. No. No. There no. you go. For the just, just, just the one that was on the, um, the goggles. Yeah. It was a long range patch, but it wasn't, um, you know, like a triple patch. That's right. Punching out like you can, you can give it like a quad. Okay, so you would recommend it for someone? Yes, I think so. I think it was pretty good. Like I, I do like the small form factor. And, and I like it that it works, which is the main thing. That, that, that is fundamental. Fundamentally the main thing. And I like how they upgraded it with the lights. So you On can the check. side, yeah, that yeah. was cool. And that's yes, it really. Well, does it, do you think from a design point of view, where do you go? Do you go smaller? Not necessarily. It's not too bad, is it? No. I guess you could do, but then you wouldn't be, it'd be overheating, so with the fan it doesn't have a problem. No, so I think, I think in 96 channels, I think that's more think than that. 96 channels, yeah, that was good. So, yeah, so the other thing is, is remember to um, uh, subscribe to the channel, because um, in the upcoming ones, or well, stay tuned nonetheless, because we're going to um, fly it, fly this bad boy with FPV. Yeah, so, so on the channel, we, if you hadn't seen already, the sustainable fly wireless helicopter. Two we, helicopters to one. Yes, and uh, we have done that, so if you haven't seen that, just go and check all the um, videos before, and um, yes, yeah, so check out the next one coming up on the channel. Yeah, so there you go, that's um, that. Okay. And if you want to get your AKK TX 5000 AC, click the affiliate link below. Now, how about the channel thing? Thank you very much. Okay, so next section. Okay, movie reviews. So the h and Journal Racing movie review of the week is... Interstellar with Matthew McConaughey and Anne Hathaway. And... Guest starring... Robots. Matt Ro Damon. Yes, <laughs> and robots. So there you go. Um, we thought that you haven't... If you haven't checked out that movie, uh, where were you? And um, it's, it's a good You one. should go and watch it. It's quite good. Yeah. There you go. And it's fourth dimension, kind of going to the idea of Einstein's theory. Um, oh, of space travel and space travel. So I thought that was quite good. I mean, you had to do it from a um, visual perspective of trying to explain that to the average average person. It's it's. it's I think they did. Confusing. I think they did quite well. I think they did quite a good uh, visual representation of it. I mean, nobody really knows what happens in the fourth, fifth, sixth, or seventh dimension. So you go. No. As who knows? Nobody's ever been there. That what we know. Of. No. That I know. No. No. So there you go. I don't know anyone that's done it. No. No. Okay. So, so that's the end of that section. There you go. That's the movie on the ring. Final thoughts. Final thoughts. Um, yes. Um, it worked. So we're happy. Yeah. It worked. So AKK did a good job. AKK Technology. Cheers. And thanks very much for um, letting us represent you. Yeah. And review it for you. So there you go. Uh, without further ado, we'll just jump into next week. Yeah. yeah. So I'm not sure what we're doing next week. But we will be making something for you. Oh, who, who knows? It'll be a surprise. Yeah. Or we might carry on with one of the other series. So make sure you remember yeah. to check out the channel to see what series we're currently on. Yes. So without further ado, I'm Harry. And I'm Richard. And we'll see each other next week in 3, a, 2, a, 1, go! Air Racing, Air Racing, Air Racing! Yeah! Eardrums, ear guitar. Yeah. Yeah. It's see you guys. Thing. See you next week. Uh, yeah, so. Yeah, so it's got a. It reckons it's 25 grams excluding the antenna. Was that right?
Yeah. Why do you have your... What, what's with this? Hobbit. Because well, I thought you were Star Trek. Star Trek. Because, you know, like, this is like super uh, innovative. It's a Hobbit. Isn't it? It says Spock. But which Hobbit? Which... Do you know the actors The, 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 the book um, series. The, 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 the book series, not the movie. Why? Because it's better. But that's not from New Zealand, it's like England. Isn't it J.R. J, uh, Tolkien? J.R. Uh, Tolkien. Why has he got two hours? I don't know. Do you know what it stands for? No, I don't know. It's, it's a mystery. But yes, it's the E's. I guess is it John? It. Is his first name? No, I don't know. Somebody out there might know. Um, you could... Uh, what's J.R. Uh, what, Tolkien's actual... What, actual what without looking at Google. Without, yeah, exactly. Without looking without at Google. Without cheating. Just, just write in a comment, what is, actual, yeah. what is his actual name? Yeah, yeah, before you had Google. There you go. Um, yeah. I think we'll just get started, eh? Let's just get started and I'll try and wiggle these off. Look at that. There you go. Oh, my ears fell. <laughs> See you guys.